What I want to do now, now that I've created um, one pillar, I want to duplicate these pillars along the one wall. Now I could do that one at a time uh, and position them one at a time, but there's actually a built-in duplicate option that allows you to create multiple copies and have them at a set um, interval apart. So we're going to have a look at that now. So I'm going to click on this pillar, make sure I've got it selected. And then I'm going to click on edit and I'm going to go down to duplicate special, which means I can duplicate something with additional properties. And I'm going to click on the options box for that. And what I want to do is I want to translate it along one of the axes. Translate is another way of saying move. And I'm moving it along this axis, along that one wall. And I can see from here that that's telling me that's going to be the X axis. So I'm going to put um, a value in the X box here. And it's really easy to know which box is which because it follows the alphabet. So this one here is X, that's Y, and that's Z. So under the translate X, I'm going to put a value of 5 in. So each one's going to move 5 units along. And then the number of copies, I want 4 copies, meaning that I'll get 5 in total. And then I'm going to click on Duplicate Special, and it's done. And you can now see that in one step, I've created um, a row of these pillars along the back wall, which looks pretty cool.